This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment, educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. So you get the videos, I put them out. See, I'm thinking, see, man, a lot of data, but like I tell you every day, they they release us as false, man, it gets a false narrative. The markets, we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, the banking sector is still in turmoil. They want to tell you that it, it, it all balanced out, that the bad times are behind us. And I'm not telling you buy, hold, or sell any bank stock. That's not what I'm telling you. What I'm telling you is based on everything I'm seeing, the banking sector is still in turmoil. It still has a lot of downside to go. Now, the optimism on the debt ceiling is what's pushing the market up. But I don't think that's going to last. But I'm not telling you buy, hold, or sell, sell any stock. But I think the market is going to see a decline within the next week that's just my opinion but you know i'm not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice but in the banking sector jp morgan is about to fire 500 people ubs is firing thousands of people well so if the banking sector was in such great condition why would all these banks be getting rid of employees and if they're getting rid of employees to show up their bottom line, do you think they're going to be making high risk loans to these hedges and bad acts so they continue naked shorting AMC, GME, Emmy Welland and the other mem stocks? I don't think so. I think that would be highly speculative and, 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 and downright dangerous given the current state of the banking sector in the United States. Well, not just the United States, not just the United States. I believe this is a global phenomenon. I believe that the problem that we have in the banking industry goes way beyond the United States because they've been known to take unnecessary risks because eventually they can get bailed out. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think the banking sector is doing great or you think that they're doing all these layoffs in all these banks because they know that the banking sector has not reached its bottom anyway have a great day god bless and i appreciate y'all on this journey with me